Academic freedom, meanwhile, in Arizona, that state becoming the first to cover tuition costs for all students to choose from any type of school they want to go to. Wow. Senior national correspondent William Lajeunesse has the details on how this works. William? Well, Bill, school choice has been conservatives' holy grail for decades. Yesterday, they achieved it in Arizona. Every family, regardless of where they live, how much they make, is eligible for an almost $7,000 a year voucher that can be used at any private, charter, home, or parochial school like this one in Phoenix. Arizona is a model for the nation now. I think what we have done with this legislation here is sort of the gold standard for what other states can take up and say, we are going to revolutionize our approach to education and make it student-centric, focused on students, not on an institution. Governor Doug Ducey signed the bill Thursday providing any of the state's 1.1 million students to opt out of public school and receive the voucher. People know we need change and improvement in K-12 education, and we know if we can empower people and empower parents, they'll make better decisions, especially better decisions than big government. No surprise, teacher unions oppose the bill, seeing it as a threat. They're expected to challenge the law by putting the issue to voters next year. With the ESA vouchers, we can't really determine that students are getting a good education. There's very little accountability academically or financially. Um, in our public schools, of course, we are accountable, not just with testing, but to parents and to a locally elected school board. Unknown is how many students will actually use the vouchers because the funding doesn't kick in until October, Bill, after the school year started. Yeah, this is a huge win for conservatives. Sure is. Yeah, Thank we'll you. watch how it develops. Thank you, William. Nice to see you. And